Right, here we are again. Hello, fellow edutainmenties. I hope you're all very well today. So this is the second video uh, on how to pronounce certain sounds or phonemes as we call them. And uh, so the two that we're going to do, as you can see on the screen left to, you, uh, to your left, uh, is the uh, long E sound and the short E sound. So let's have a look at those. Uh, right, there they are. I've highlighted them in red and blue. All right, so the dot, the first one in red is the long sound, E. And the second one is E, E. So we'll do those individually. All right, now for the first one, the um, long sound, uh, the one in red, here are a couple of vowel combinations. When you when you see these vowel combinations, uh, they will usually make this sound e e. And you can see that uh, my mouth is smiling, showing my teeth e e. Now the tongue at the back is a little bit tight on the sides, up underneath the teeth e e. All right, so a little bit more rigid than the shorter sound, which I'll show you in a minute. So say E, E. Okay, you must always be smiling when you say this sound. Okay, so there we go. This phoneme has a long sound, okay? E, good. Uh, so let's look at some words. Always helpful if we say that sound in words. So the first one is treat, 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 ease, ease, team, team, tree, tree, me, me, bleed, bleed. Okay, so you can see every time I say that sound, I smile. Okay, so that's the easiest way to remember that one. Okay, let's have a look at the short sound. The short sound is I. Now, you can see my mouth is the same, I, and the tongue is sort of in the same position, the sides of the tongue just underneath the teeth, but it's a much softer sound. The back of your tongue doesn't rise up quite as much. I, I. E. All right? E. Uh, now, what I recommend is when you're making any sounds is to open the recorder on your, uh, on your mobile phone and say these words yourself and then compare them to what I'm saying. And in this way, you can see if you're getting it right because quite often we can't hear what we're saying properly. So it's good to listen to it from a recording. So try that. Okay, so this is the short sound. So let's have a look at a couple of uh, words, a couple, more than a couple. You know, a couple means two. <laughs> so more than two. Let's have a look at these. So e, e, trick. E, e, trick. E, e, is. E, e, is. E, e, hissing. S snakes like to hiss. E, e, hissing. E, e, did. E, e, did. E, e, bit. Now, I recommend saying the sound first before the word. It's much easier to say the word if you've just said that sound. So do it that way. E, e, did. E, e, bit. Okay? Good way to do it. All right, now we're going to combine them. Now, when you combine these two sounds and different words, you can hear and feel the difference in your face. So let's do that. So do it after me, and I'll go slowly. E, E, treat. E, E, trick. E, ease. E, is. E, team. E, pin. E, 
healing, e hissing, e deal, e did, e lease, e link, e read, e bid, e peak, e rid. Okay, e e e e. Okay, so I wonder how you did there. So let's read some words together, and uh, I've highlighted the sounds in the words. So let's have a look at those. So big deal. Now I always say overdo it, overemphasize these sounds, right? Um, and eventually it'll they'll be come so easy for you that you'll shorten them back, you'll turn them back to how they're meant to be sounds. So overdo it. So big deal, big deal, plead guilty, plead guilty, to be in recession, recession, quantitative easing, Quantitative easing, quantitative easing, seizing the opportunity, seizing the opportunity. Now remember the TH can be pronounced the or the, depending on whether the following word starts with a vowel or consonant. And here it starts with the vowel. So we go the opportunity. Okay. So that's good practice for you. Um, uh, oh, we've got some more. Leaving university. Leaving university. Security council. Security council. Commodities trading. Commodities trading. Committee meeting committee meeting agree to disagree business deal business deal people skills people skills now I'll read them again so you can hear how we normally say them not in this exaggerated way all right so leaving university security council commodities training committee meeting agree to disagree business deal and people skills all right so that's how you would say them without sounding like an idiot like me right now <laughs> All right, so we've got some more. So let's say it in a little bit more normal fashion. All right, so the building was besieged by the police. The victim is being treated in hospital. I believe we need a meaningful discussion regarding the issue. There is a high degree of subjectivity in what he said. Good leaders are focused and driven. They surround themselves with great people and aren't afraid to take calculated risks. Right, now this is just a little short poem for fun for you to read. Now I haven't highlighted uh, the sounds here, so practice and see how you manage this. Okay, greatly pleased with interest rates. To get a mortgage, we decide, with all our finances so great, not a chance to be declined. <laughs> so are your finances so good that you'll be able to get a mortgage and buy a house? I hope so, one day, if not now. All right, so practice those, and I hope that's a good follow-up video for you from our lesson that we did on these two sounds in class. Okay, so thanks again, everybody. And I appreciate the wonderful feedback. It makes it worthwhile for me to do it. So take care.